work shed. Hello everybody, welcome to the work shed. Today we're going to be playing the critically acclaimed Kickstarter game, Super Hot. Super Hot was originally developed for the 2013 7 day first person shooter challenge in which teams were given a week to develop a prototype game. According to Super Hot's director Pietr Iwernicki, this project was inspired by the Flash game Time for Cat in which the player controls a cat trying to collect food on a busy road intersection and time only moved when the player did. They were also inspired by the music video of Bad Motherfuckers by the Russian band Biting Elbows. That video featured a first person perspective of a secret agent escaping a hostage situation through parkour and gunplay. That production team is now releasing a first person movie called Hardcore Henry in theaters April 8th, 2016. Which sounds a whole lot like Mirror's Edge. The Super Hot team combined these ideas for the challenge prototype and came up with the name by considering the two words, super and hot alone are positive and intense and made for a good mantra within the game the challenge prototype is considered episodic due to it featuring three levels across three computers they refined the game and released it as a free browser game in 2013 within a week the game had become the fastest game to be processed through steam's green light iwinicky stated that the positive reaction to the web demo was a result of players looking for any variation in the state of formula of first person shooters which had not really changed since the development of Doom. I don't know if I agree with that, but sure. Iwinicki commented that while some have called Super Hot a puzzle game, he feels it remains an action game. Unlike a puzzle game where there is typically only one solution and one reward for that, Iwinicki considers Super Hot to be about having the time to adjust to one's instincts and improvise a strategy for completing a challenge. In May 2014, the development team launched the Kickstarter campaign to make Super Hot a full release. They ran into problems since they were in Poland and the country wasn't supported by Kickstarter at the time. Once worked out, the Kickstarter met its goal within the first day of going live. The campaign ended with more than $230,000 in pledging funding. What's this? Interesting. Little, uh, Max Headroom? The, from the Pepsi commercials, it's a little freaky. Super the hot. Super. The like pixelized Amiga version of the game's trailer. That's pretty cool. I don't know what RSMs. Uh, These people are completely what? fine. What? They are just enjoying a new exciting video game. Video games have been scientifically what? proven to improve problem solving and motor what skills. The hell is this? Awareness, social skills, and stress control. What am I watching? Although it takes just 10 seconds to play. play. This game brings in an endless competitive. I think the Matrix is pulling me in! Your family and your friends. <laughs> and the best part is, this what? game is available now for everyone to enjoy. <laughs> Was this the uh, least a tel tel telephone and some cardboard? I can't really read something and remember, about mental. Play responsibly and don't mix with drugs. Uh, I feel like I've been dosed with drugs. That was very bizarre. What was that? Um, oh, I don't have VR, so there's no point. I didn't think they, uh, finished the VR support yet. Maybe they did. So, yeah, the, the interface is a little weird. Uh, that's by design by Marcin Sumer, who also came on the idea of presenting the game as something that might have emerged from the 1990s, during the periods of MS-DOS and Amiga computer systems, which spawned the metagame interface and all the weird menus, 
Sumo considered how this approach continued the theme of contrast that the game presented as the enemies stand out in stark contrast to the environment, the 3D game stands out similarly from the, the character based menu screens. What? Okay. Um, computer systems and uh, Sumo considered how those blah blah blah. Alright, let's uh, let's get into the game, actual game. Secrets not cracked. I don't know what that means. Uh, I think I broke it. Did I break the... Wow, that is a very big contrast. According to director Marcin Suma, the art style is minimalistic and only uses three principal colors. White for the environment, black for the objects the player can interact with, and red for the enemies. This choice was made during the creation of the demonstration primarily to allow the team to focus on the gameplay aspects for the 7 day first person challenge. Uh, oh, time moves only when you move. Okay, I kind of figure that. Sumo, who had not been able to participate in the challenge but brought on after the decision to expand the game, kept with this approach as it made it clear to the player what they had to focus on. Oh, I totally missed, didn't I? Distilling out the common distractions that will be used for first person shooters. There we go. Super hot. hot. Super, Super hot. hot. Super hot. Super hot. Super hot. Super hot. Super hot. Okay, so that's basically the basics of the game. I guess. So yeah, black objects I can interact with. White's the environment and Red's enemies. That's uh, very simplistic and awesome. Let's shoot you. And, oh, I gotta wait for it to reload. That's annoying. Shoot you, oh, really? Now oh, you're dead. Gotcha. It was a setup, no! Okay, cool. I gotta make sure I can actually lead these guys correctly. Which is, get his, Oh, that was easy. Super hot. Super hot. Super hot. Super Okay, it's just gonna keep hot. going until I click away. Okay. This is really cool. Very interesting game. Oh! Uh, <laughs> yeah. I didn't know there was a bullet behind that guy. Oh, he sh was shooting through him. Okay. Now I know. There's no ducking. I am Neo from the Ma- Ooh, that was close. Thread the Matrix! Oh, that bolt's coming straight from me. Thread the needle! Yes, oh! Fire and dodge! Uh, I hesitate too long. So time moves very slow. It's not actually- Ah, oh, I forgot. There's gonna be a lot of that. So time moves very slow. It's not- actually frozen when you're not moving because the bullets are still please be close uh all right so this is going to take a little while to get used to i guess so they actually the bullets aren't scripted they're actually all aiming for me Ooh, that was close all right so now i'm in cover oh mm. Huh. Oh, nope. Side step, strafing, strafing. Grab the gun. And shoot. And, uh, did I get that? Did I actually shoot that one or was I still reloading at the time? I think I was reloading at the time. There we go. Super. I got him. Super okay. Hot. Super hot. Super hot. Super, Super hot. hot. Okay. <laughs> I wonder if that's gonna get old. This is a really cool game. I really enjoyed so far. Um. Uh, right click to throw my gun at people. Punch. Okay. He's still alive. Not no more. Lead. Oh, still reloading. There we go. That wasn't enough. Oh, I'm, 
I'm sort of used to, uh... Oh! Okay. That's how that's gonna go. Oh, uh, this is not gonna end well. Throw the bottle! Oh! He didn't have a gun for me to steal. Okay. I'm sort of used to, uh, leading people in games. Because I usually play sniper. But that's, uh, not really going to help you here. Because that, I mean, I'm normally used to, uh, well, f leading in full motion, not slow motion like this. I'm not going to have enough time to... Oh, maybe I will. Super. Oh, wow. That worked out better Super. than I expected. Super. Yeah, it's Super. very different leading Hulk. someone in slow motion than in live in real time. Come with us. Uh, missed that. Left click. Oh. <laughs> Waited too long. Two for one, two for one! Oh, really? I was hoping I could get two kills for the price I won't. Oh, that's gonna miss. Oh, no, I got him. Oh, didn't know there was another guy coming. Oh, sh Am I good? Oh, he came out of no. Oh. I hope there's no one behind me. Am I good? Am I sit? Oh! Oh, there's an old stairwell there! Oh, I didn't know that. Great. Uh, oh. Oh, that was close. I almost forgot. Uh, let's get you for it. Don't lose your head. So he can't shoot people. Shoot, shoot through people. It's good to know. I don't remember that guy coming so quickly. Um. Oh, uh, someone shoot a gun. Oh, crap, that's... Oh, no, good. Grab a gun. Who? Come on. Reload. And I think I'm good. Super. Nope. Yeah! Super Got you, son. Hot. Super hot. Super, Super hot. hot. Super, Super hot. Yeah, it's not going to get old at all. <laughs> it's a cool mantra. Um, all right. Oh. Oh. I didn't break it. I was going to say, this is a little weird. Having no one to interact with. Oh! Did I just go through the Animus? What? What? Oh. I got an incoming message. Follow the white rabbit, Neo. What did you think? Oh. Uh, that's not what I typed. Interesting idea, not sure. I was going to say, that was pretty cool. Not sure what I'm supposed to be doing, though. I think I was in a factory, when then an alley, and a subway. <laughs> awesome. Everyone gets something different. Am I in the Matrix? Am I Neo? That's one word for it. Okay. This is uh really cool. I wasn't expecting something like this. Uh, like a weird chat-based narrative. Some bad glitches at the end. Unauthorized. Some things that kick me out. Yeah, I got kicked out of the game. Enter. At first, I thought I would be like, able to actually like write my responses, and there'd be like some sort of AI, I guess, that would respond. But I mean, it makes more sense that it's actually a scripted base. But no matter what you hit, it types out what this supposed to be typing. New file seems to crash less. All right, let's go back into 1990. Into I uh, just created a portal. Cool. Really cool game. I, like, really enjoy this. No wonder why everyone's, like, raving on about it. I'm so happy I kickstarted. Oh, I did Mario. Where'd the gun go? 
Oh. I think there's an achievement for Mario or something. Uh, that should be good. See? Oh, I didn't get him? I'm a little dis uh, nervous because, like, people could come from all directions. There's, like, no like, standardized spawn point. Oh, I'm gonna run out of ammo here. Yeah. Oh, no. What? What the hell happened? Oh, I think there's another car. Yeah, Mario! It's -a me, Mario! Achievement unlocked. Sweet. Alright. That was led terribly. Let's go with that. No? I'm gonna get shot. Right, so there's this guy. Uh, where's this guy's gun? I'll take that. Shoot you. Lead him. Oh, uh, too high. That might be good. Hope no one spawns behind me. That's gonna hit him. Yes. Oh, crap. Uh, let's hope for the best on this one. Die! No one? Oh, you're still alive. Super. Oh, yeah! Super. Super. Hot. Hot. Super. This is so cool. It's such a it's a simple concept that like no one's ever done it before. No beer. Uh, what? I don't know where that guy's gun went, which really stinks. Oh, the hell happened there? It just exploded. Oh, I'm hitting the taps. Yeah, come behind the bar. Oh, I'm sh gonna get shot. I'm too- uh, Oh! How did I not- Give me a gun! Thank you! Alright. I'm in pretty good shape. I took out three guys already. Four. Reload. Ooh! Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good. Ooh! Oh! Damn! It's so close! Oh, I kept hitting the wrong button for the... Oh, the gun flew over there. That's why I couldn't get it before. Oh, I'm in bad... Very bad spot. Oh! Oh, I'm so screwed. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh, I saw that coming a mile away. <laughs> Alright. Uh, the gun jumped over here. Come on, grab it. Okay. Ooh, reload, please. Oh, I didn't kill this guy? Oh, that's gonna miss. Nope. Oh, that was unfortunate. Recovery! You're gonna be there? No? Let's go with that. Yeah, there we go. Anybody else? I'm gonna need a new gun probably right now. Yep. Uh, hope I have enough time. Yeah. Walk into. Oh. Um. No one, please. Okay. Where'd that gun come from? Shit. Oh, this is terrible. Super. Did I get? Oh, nice. Hot. Got him. Super. All right. Super. Super hot. hot. Super hot. hot. Super hot. hot. All right. Super Next time in the workshop, we're gonna keep Super on playing this game. Hot. This is really cool. Super I'm really enjoying hot. this. If you're enjoying this, Super stay tuned for more, hot. and please join me next Super time. Son, I'm hurt! I'm hurt! I'm stuck in the wall! <laughs>